Hi, today we'll be talking about multi-pass assemblers. In the given set of instructions, beta cannot be resolved in the first pass and hence alpha cannot be resolved in the second pass. Solution to this problem of forward reference is to use a multi-pass assembler. A multi-pass assembler is an assembler that makes as many passes as necessary to process the definition of symbols. In the case of multi-pass assemblers, in the symbol table we have some extra information along with the symbol name. We also have the defining expression and the number of undefined symbols in the defining expression. Let us take an example. If you look at the first um, statement, half size equals max length by 2. The way this is stored in the symbol table is like this half size along with that we have the number of undefined symbols in the defining expression which is max length by 2 max length by 2 is the defining expression and the number of unknowns in this particular expression is 1 hence we have ampersand 1 with this um, entry for half size we also add an entry for max length but that we mark with a star to show that it is an undefined symbol. Along with the entry for half size, an entry for max length is also added which is marked with an asterisk to show that it is an undefined symbol. Along with this we also have a depending list with a linked list which contains the address of half size. To show that the symbol half size is dependent on max length. So that as soon as max length is resolved, this address can be used to res resolve half size. In the same way, we can resolve the rest of the mm, mm, instructions. In this case, max length equal to buff and minus buffer. We already have an entry for max length, but since the defining expression contains two unknowns, as you can see here, buff end and buffer so we have ambusen 2 which denotes that there are two unknowns along with that we also add in two entries for buffer and buff end and to show that both are undefined symbols we add an asterisk but along with that we also have the depending list which contains a link list of max length similarly we also have the same procedure for previous bit.